Hello friends, welcome back to my channel technology and in this video I am going to give you a top 10 tips by which you can boost up your computer speed so you just need to follow me and don't forget to subscribe my channel because it's really encourage me and motivate me to make more videos like this and as well as you will get a notification whenever I will upload a new tech related videos on my channel. So please do subscribe guys, it's free. <laughs> is set a wallpaper as a solid color so for that you need to right click on your desktop and after that click on the personalized settings and after that you need to click on desktop background from here and after that from here you need to select from this panel the picture location you need to select solid color sorry uh, solid color and after that you need to select your wallpaper from here so for me i will select this this one this uh, the blackish color the darkest color so after that click on save change and close it so number two is uh, delete your tem file from your computer so for that you need to open your run first press window and r button together or you can uh, go through your start menu also just type your run and after that you need to select this run box and after that you will get uh, this run dialog box on your computer so here you need to type slash temp percentage uh, percentage uh, temp percentage sorry uh, this is temp and percentage so after that click on enter or press ok from here click on ok so after that select all this um, uh, file from here just press ctrl and a after that uh, press shift delete from your uh, keyboard and click on yes so after that your all the temporary file will be delete from here so now uh, the next next one is ms config so for that you need to open your run box again just pressing windows and r button together after that here you need to type msconfig and after that click on enter or ok and after that you need to go to your startup and from here you need to stop all this program which you don't want to uh, stop for, uh, start up on your on your when your computer will be start so i don't need power iso virtual this one and also add up updater i don't need this and add up service manager this one also so after that click on apply and ok so now you need to restart your computer to uh, apply these settings so i will uh, click on exit without restart because i i don't want to restart it now so number four is uh, run your computer as a server mode so for that you need to go to your start menu and after that here you need to right click on your my computer and click on manage or you can uh, go to your my computer after that right right click on this blank space uh, area this one and after that you need to go to your properties and after that from here you need to select a uh, change settings and from here you need to click on advanced settings and here you need to select this performance click on this settings button and now uh, you need to choose this option is called adjust for best performance and after that click on apply and then so now it will take some time to load so now uh, just a minute after that click on ok as you can see the all the graphical uh, mod is disabled from your from my computer as you can see so number five is disk cleaner so for that you need to go to your start menu and after that click on all program and then accessories and then system tool and here you will get one option is called disk cleaner and from here you need to select which uh, drive you need to clean uh, clean up your disk so i will select c drive and after that click on ok so after that it will calculating and scanning my all the uh, use unused uh, data 
so after that click on ok and delete file so it's done so number six is uh, disable your theme so for that you need to open your uh, run box from your from your uh, on your computers to pressing windows and r button together and after that here you need to type services.msc and after that here you type uh, find one uh, service is called themes so you need to right click on themes and after that click on properties and here you need to click on this disable okay and after that click on apply and then okay so number seven is windows search so for that you need to open the run box again and after that you need to uh, type on your services.msc and here you need to type services.msc and after that click on ok and from here you need to uh, uh, search one file is called windows search so let me yes this one so you need to disable this option from here you need to disable and click on apply and ok ok so number 8 is virtual memory so for that you need to go to your my computer and right click on your uh, right click on this uh, blank area and after that go to the properties and after that click on this change setting button and after that you need to uh, go to this advanced settings and then click on settings and here you will get one option is called advanced okay after that click on this change button and you need to uncheck this automatically manage uh, paging file size so this one and after that you need to click on this custom size and and after that as you can see the recommended is uh, 8968 MB so I will put that MB on there same same amount on there 8968 and after that click on set and ok so it will show me to you have to restart your computer to uh, apply these changes so I will click on ok and apply and ok then cancel number 9 is disk defragment so for that you need to go to your start menu and after that all program and here you will get one option is called accessories and after that you need to go system tools and here you will get one option is called disk disk, disk fragment so after that you need to after open the, the disk disk fragment so you need to click on this defract uh, defragment uh, disk click on there so after that it will take some time so number 10 is ready boost so for that you need to go to your my computer and after that you need to insert your pen drive which I already inserted on my computer as you can see here is my pen drive so after that you need to right click over the pen drive and go to your properties and here you will get one option is called ready boost and after that you need to select this option is called use this device and after that you have to set how much uh, MB uh, you need to set uh, for to boost up your computer so I will select all and after that you need to click on apply and then ok so after that as you can see the ready was is successfully configured on my computer so I hope this video will really helpful for you and please don't forget to click on the subscribe button like button and share button and if you have any queries or question then comments below see you on next video next time take care